Hey y'all, welcome back to the sawmill. Today we are putting the sawmill back together from where we took it apart to um, have the concrete slab poured. We have some orders that we have to finish up and then we're gonna start cutting uh, timber for the shed that we are building over the sawmill so that we don't have to stand out in the hot blistering Florida sun um, cutting all these, uh, getting all these orders cut for our customers. So y'all stay tuned. sawmill back together but now don't get me wrong I love wood mine see that little square nut in there well partly my fault because I didn't put any seeds on them so now they're spinning some of them are spinning not all of them so I had to take a tire iron because I don't have a welder which Again, my fault. But drive a tire iron into there and then take a clamp and clamp it so it'll hold the nut while turning it with a pressure wrench because the nuts are metric. They're not standard, which I don't have a metric wrench that big. Put a cheater bar on it. So I can readjust the feet. And that's where we're at. Alright, so I got two bed sections. Got the legs freed up. And got them working well. All but one. Could not get one. And I don't have a welder, so I couldn't weld the nut. So it was about to where I wanted it anyway, five inches. So I just set all the rest of the feet to match that one. Got one more in the barn. Got to get it freed up. Actually, it's two bed sections. And then uh, we'll get them set in place. Get it all bolted back together. Got the saw head over there. We'll get it put on and be back to sawing. I've got the, the other two bed sections in the barn so I can work on it, get them freed up. I tell you, the little square headed nuts, they are not the best design you can't get a wrench in there all you can do is drive something in there and try to wedge it but if you can see but they just it just rolls the edge look at that very 
very poor design, wooden nizer. Y'all need to do better. All right. That was a struggle. Like, I got all four bed sections on. And I just gotta pull them together, get them bolted together, and then leveled, secure the feet to the wood. I hadn't bolted the platform yet to the concrete. I'm gonna let it cure for a couple weeks before I do that, but it'll be set on the skids. Get the saw head back on and be ready to saw. She is back together. Leveled, bolted down, ready to saw some wood. Hopefully, sooner than later, we'll have a shed over it. <laughs>